Good morning everybody. It is 6.35 and I just shot my video for Saturday and it is what morning? Tuesday morning. Just shot my video for Saturday and I'm uploading the footage and it's funny I need to answer Elle's question um, on the video. I'll answer it in her comment but um, when I say there are two ways I upload footage. First I upload it from my SD card into my laptop and then edit it, convert it, and then I upload it to YouTube. So if that was confusing to anybody that does YouTube videos, sorry. Um, I just refer to them as the same. I, I don't know why. So that is some cold coffee. We are done with that. <laughs> so I just, um, let's see. I have no idea when you guys are going to be seeing this. I never quite know now that I don't have a set schedule. I don't ever quite know when these are going up, but... I was sh shooting a review on the Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Foundation. Spoiler alert. Not so much. Um, I'm not deciding what shoes I'm going to wear today, and I have to tell you, I may wear my, um, just my tennis shoes today, because my foot, the plantar fasciitis foot, is giving me issues, and, and I don't know why. Yesterday I wore my Vionic sandals to work, so I, I wore the ones that have the support, and I, I mean, I did walk last night on the treadmill, but I don't know. Anyway, so outfit is not anything super exciting. These are not your daughter's jeans. These are the ones that have a little bit of butt interest, as I like to say, and um, this is that Marisa's mint green t-shirt. I have a mint green t-shirt, or mint green, um, tank underneath it. Nothing really exciting. These earrings were a gift from a subscriber in Germany. Her name is Christy. 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 I always say it wrong. It's Christy. Um, and I love them. And then this was from Bob for anniversary. So yeah, I really feel like I might wear my tennis shoes to work now. You know, I'll wear wedges. I'll show you. I'm going to grab a cardigan too because, you know, cold in the office. So the weather is so nice, you guys. So nice. I feel like um, that I complain about the weather enough that when it's nice, I ought to, I ought to tell you guys that as well. So it's been beautiful. Mid seventies, the humidity went away. I think the, what did they say? The temperature in a half hour on Sunday dropped like 30 degrees. No, 25. Must've been 25 degrees something like that, but it was crazy. So, let me switch around my... So this, these are the ones These are the ones from Kohl's. These are so comfortable. There's another gal at work that has a pair like this. And she and I were talking that <clears throat> we like them so much. I may go... I may buy the other, the other colors unless they're sold out. It is practically the end of summer. So, fashion-wise, anyway, if you're buying stuff, it's the end of summer. But, so I was thinking I may go ahead and buy... Um, the other colors if they have them because they're so comfortable and they these don't hurt my feet my foot just hurts in general right now so anyway that's what's happening nothing uh, nothing nice to show you outside I missed I missed the sunrise of course um, but what are you gonna do had a better hair day today than yesterday and for those of you that are curious pretty much what I'm doing at this point is um, for, this is for my hair issue and it's you know I work out and it's all gross and sweaty and I don't know what to do I've just been, I've just given up and I'm washing it every day. So, um, I wash it at night after I take, you know, I take my shower after working out, wash it at night. And then when I get up in the morning, I just stick my head under the, um, under the faucet in the bathtub and get it all wet and then start over. So at night it just completely air dries and I don't have any product in it. And then, um, you know, then in the morning I air, I let it air dry a little bit and then I hit it with the diffuser. So I have a hair appointment on Saturday. And I need to ask Eric if, if he thinks that that's okay. Like, am I, is the getting it wet and letting it air dry okay for it? Or is that going to hurt? It? Ooh, that's a big spider. On the outside, not on the inside. Okay, well, no spider fear. I was going to show you guys the spider. <laughs> anyway, that's, that, that is it. I'm just rambling. But, um, yeah, I'm going to talk to Eric and see if he thinks that the way I'm doing it will hurt my hair in any way, shape, or form. Or if it will still be okay. Because you know these are first world problems. <laughs> Alright, with that, I'm going to pack up my stuff and head on to work. Good morning, everybody. It's quarter to six, Wednesday morning. I wasn't even going to do a check-in today because I need to get to work really early today. <clears throat> However, 
the sunrise. <laughs> cannot be skipped today. I just feel like you can't really capture it in the camera, but I'm just doing the best that I can. Oh, maybe. Oh, it's so pretty, like up here. I can't even. I'm actually going to take my coffee and I'm going to stand here for a few minutes. And just appreciate it. Because I'm a fruitcake. <laughs> what can I say? I think I might snap a picture. Like, on Snapchat. Snap. <laughs> I'm trying. I usually get a couple in the morning and then you don't, excuse me, you don't see me the rest of the day. Eh, what are you going to do? So, shh, I'm wearing stripes today. Shh. I love this shirt. I've had this shirt for so long. I got it at H&M. Um, oh my gosh, I don't even know. Like, three, four years ago, something like that. I love it. If you've been around a little bit, you've seen me wear it in lots of videos. I don't wear it much anymore because, of course, it's striped. But I love this scoop neck on it. That's one of the things I love about it. And, of course, navy blue, as I've said, is, like, my favorite color. And anything that's navy blue striped, sign me up for so anyway, um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go, I'm about to go put on the simplest makeup of life, like as quick as I can get in and out of there. I'm hoping to get to work by quarter after six or so at the latest. Like, well, quarter, between quarter after six and 6.30. I can get so much done in one hour or an hour and a half before the rest of the world gets there. You would be surprised. So, sorry, shortest check-in of life. If I have a chance, I'll check in after my makeup. I'm going to try the Born This Way Foundation for the first time. And I actually bought the lightest shade. I even hauled that because I did it on Sunday when my haul was going live. So, I may throw up a quick um, haul. Or actually, oh, you guys will already see this by the time I've had to make the decision. I got the Allure Beauty Thrills box. It used to be called the Allure Beauty box or whatever. And I've skipped the last couple of ones. But this one was really, I felt like it was good. And there was enough products in it that I would use. And things that I thought, fr you know, friends and family would use that I went ahead and got it. <clears throat> and I usually do an unboxing of that. So I might try to do that on Sunday if I get a chance. I hope that you guys want to see that. So I may, um, I may put a picture on Instagram to see if people still want to see that. Because you can't get the box anymore, but usually it doesn't matter. People still want to see it. So I just want to give you guys what you want. <laughs> I don't want to put up something you guys are not interested in watching. So, all right, I'm going to go take five minutes. appreciate the... The, the glory that is the sky out there, the masterpiece he has created. And um, I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. Good morning, everybody. It is 6.05 Thursday morning. Just a little bit. A little bit of sunrise, you can see. I am up and ready earlier than normal today. Well, actually, no. Probably the same time, but um, I'm not filming or anything today. It's pretty. Not as much like pink and orange, though. Um, so I have a customer visit, so to speak, today. And it's actually in, um, I don't know, normally I'm just at my customer. I'm going with my customer to their customer. And um, <laughs> I'm fairly certain. Um, I don't think I've ever had to go in in. A facility like this but um, it's a food facility so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to like put you know hairnet stuff over my clothes like full-on top to bottom um anyway so that's why I'm all dressed up though is the point is that I'm I'm not going to the office until much later today so I am wearing and this is really nothing all that oh you know what I have to get a necklace yet um, but these are just gray pants, which I don't understand. They used to fit really well, but now they're really long or something. And I've worn these shoes with them before. I don't know. Anyway, um, this is just like an orchid kind of color um, cami from Lane Bryant. And this is that jacket from Torrid that I have talked about and shown many times. Um, and earrings are David Yearman earrings. The beautiful amethyst in them. And I'm just going to put on a silver, that silver still in dot necklace, actually. Which reminds me, I don't think I said on this channel, so I just want to let you guys know. If you do want to order from that, from my trunk show, which <laughs> you don't have to, I'm just saying. <laughs> um, then everybody that, that places an order gets entered, and I'm giving away $150 of the credit that you can earn or whatever if people order stuff. I gotta put this necklace on. Um, yeah, so anybody who places an order or every order that you place or whatever, if you did separate orders, I, I don't know, 
<laughs> your name will go in, and I'll um, I'll have Natalie the Natalie from Flower Bomb Thirty One who's hosting the show. She'll give me a list of the names of the people that ordered, and we'll pick one, and they will get one hundred fifty dollars in credit. So I think I explained that on my main channel, but I don't think I explained it on this channel when I was talking about it. So just in case you don't watch the other channel, I wanted to give you a heads up on that. And yeah, that is about it. So this is the this necklace. I have this one in gold, and this is the Devon D E V O N necklace and in silver. Um, and the reason that I got it in silver is because I wear that gold one so much, and I don't really have a silver one that's just like a plain, throw it on, easy to wear kind of necklace like this one is. So that's why I got that. I can't decide if I want it all like hanging down onto my shirt or what. Anyway. Ay, ay, ay. So I got a lot of feedback on the haul video that I posted on um, Sunday that you guys do want to see a fall lookbook. So I'm going to try to figure that out. It's hard because there's no place in my house I can really do that. So what I was thinking of doing is, first of all, we'd have to burn the things that are currently in in the fireplace because who wants to look at or in the pit because who wants to look at that but I thought I maybe could set the camera up on the deck somehow and be on the deck you know be on the patio um so I don't know that's the only reason really that I haven't done one at this point um it's because I just don't know how it's going to look and I would be filming it by myself you know unless Carissa would come over she, she would probably come help me if she had time but anyway so I'm going to pack up a few things for my little lunch thing. Eventually I'll be in the office. This customer is about an hour and a half. Yeah, about an hour and a half from the office. So it's, I, I'm, I'm tired just thinking about my day. And then I'm gonna, I am gonna have to get home and I have to get on that treadmill. Because yesterday I didn't get home from work until really, really late. And there was no treadmill action happening. I needed to get dinner for Bob and stuff. So. All right, with that, I am off. And, oh, my face. I was going to tell you guys my face of the day because I've been forgetting. So, where did I go the last time? It seemed like it was pretty good. <laughs> I think this is the thought that's pretty good. So, I have the Dior Star foundation. I have that new Estee Lauder um, loose powder over the top of that. My cheeks are max, I was going to say soft and gentle, but no, just max gentle, that mineralized blush. On my eyes, I pulled out my Guerlain Le Fume quad. Yeah, it's a quad. And lips are Heavenly Hybrid by MAC. So, that is what I'm sporting today. And with that, I'm packing up and I will see you guys later. Good morning, everybody. It is Friday morning. It is 5.40. And, you know, it's raining outside, by the way, which we're very thankful for. We needed some rain. Um, that is the Keurig that you hear. So, and ignore my hair today, I don't know what, I, I was trying to, this is the second day hair, and um, yeah, this is as good as it was getting. Anyway, this is one of those mornings, um, I mean, so many of you are like, how do you get up early in the morning? Well, some days I don't want to, so today I didn't get up until 5, my alarm went up, my alarm always goes off at 4, and I get up between 4 and 4.30, but this is one of those days, I'm pretty tired, it's been a really long week. Yesterday was a really long day. What did I leave? What time did I leave the house? 6.30. And I didn't get home until 5.30, which can sometimes be my normal hours of being gone, but with having to drive to a customer and back, I don't know. I just was tiring. So, <laughs> the point of this is, it was definitely one of those mornings where I could have just laid in bed and listened to it rain because normally in the morning in the summer, in the summer when the fresh air is there and everything, the birds are like loud and obnoxious and while, while I enjoy hearing the birds in the morning and enjoy, you know, I'm trying to enjoy that part of summer, when it was raining the birds were not out there and being loud and it was just soft and raindrops and I was you know, cool, I could smell the fresh air. You know, do you feel, is anybody getting what I'm laying, anybody pick it up when I'm laying down? Oh, so I just wanted to lay in bed, but I did not. I got up out of bed and I answered a few comments and um, got ready and am about getting about my day. So I I think I got last night caught up, uh, in the past couple days, caught up on all but one video. I get a little behind when I do, um, like a bonus video and last week I had a Thursday and a Sunday video which is on my main channel which is not normal so
Um, yeah, but I'm just about caught up. I just have to answer comments on Topic Tuesday's video, which is way late because it's Friday. But I'm hoping to, I'm just going to do like the simplest of simple makeup and I'll show you guys when I'm done. But I mean, I'm going to hardly put anything on um, today because it's, I mean, I'm not filming today. I'm tired today. Sometimes I just, sometimes. So, and then I'm going to get to, to work, um, do the couple things I need to do and maybe answer some comments if I have time before I start and then I'll finish on my lunch if I don't. Um, oh no, I will not finish on my lunch. I would have to finish tonight because... Big news! We're getting finally getting new carpet in our house. Uh, we have been putting that off for quite some time for a couple of reasons. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna take you in my makeup room and I'll talk to you about the carpet. So, <clears throat> by the way, I put on Instagram if anybody wanted to see this box here. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Um, this is that Allure Beauty Thrills box, and then that's actually the stuff that I got at Sephora. I had a couple of things after the fact that I wanted to order with like the four times the points or whatever. But I'm a little bit bummed, I gotta say, because two of them are these new eyeshadow bars, I think they call them, but they're just eyeshadow singles from Buxom. And I totally didn't pay attention, which is not like me, but I totally didn't pay attention to the fact that um, you need to, I need to order the palette, and there's, I only ordered two of them. Hopefully, oh, while I plug in my laptop here. Um, I only ordered two of them and I don't really want six of them. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So, all right. Carpet. First of all, we have had the same carpet. Now let's remember, oops, I, I can't, I can never tell really what you guys can see. Um, we have had the same carpet since, I mean, since the house was built, and it was built like two years, I think, before we moved into it, um, and there's one family that lived here, so we've lived here almost, well, we've lived here 12 years, yeah, something like that, so I think maybe it might have been 13, it doesn't really matter, it's a long time, it's not, that's not important, so do you guys ever have where it looks like you have mascara underneath your eyes still from the day before, but you actually don't? I was sure that it, I had some on there, but apparently I did not. Um, so, I have been, <laughs> I've been asking Bobby if we can replace the carpet for quite some time now. The reason we haven't done it, this is legit the reason we haven't done it, is because neither one of us, I lived in a, I lived in a, you know, apartment after apartment after apartment. When I bought my house, before Bob, I bought a house before Bob when I was 27. Yeah, I bought a house, just a little one. And I did replace one room of carpet up in the upstairs of that house, like the, it was a Cape Cod. So the, the upstairs of the house was almost like a separate, complete, complete separate area. My brother lived with me for a while. And <clears throat> when he moved in between him moving out and us deciding to sell him, whatever, we were going to turn that into like a master suite. But I'm getting way more into this than I need to. The moral of the story is, um, in case you're wondering what I'm about to put on my face, it's the Pond's BB cream. The moral of the story is that I honestly didn't know, try not to laugh and think I'm an idiot. I honestly did not know what, to, like how, what, how would we deal with all of our furniture? Because we want to replace all of it in the whole house. And I thought it would cost us more for them to come like, two different days and I just didn't know how to deal with it so finally I went in and <laughs> you know what it boils down to so I didn't want to look dumb I didn't want to look dumb and but finally I was like you know what that's just ridiculous Kristen so I went in and I told the lady I said okay so here's here's the deal you know we've had our carpeting for and for any of you that happen to be new we don't have pets and we don't have kids which is why we were able to get so much so long out of our carpet I think I don't know so anyway, I told her, I said, we've never replaced carpet. I don't know. I don't know the first thing about it. I don't know. I don't know anything. So you need to start from scratch and talk to me like I know nothing. And she was so nice. I went in um, earlier this week on my lunch um, to just kind of talk through some of it and get an idea. So we did that. I picked out some carpet. So today I'm on, um, Bob has to work Saturday again. 
boo. But, I mean, I guess it's okay as far as I have to go get my, you know, my hair appointment this is Saturday. But I just feel badly that he's having to work all these Saturdays again. Anyway. Um, so we're going to go. He's going to leave a little bit early today so that we can go over on, like, my lunch hour-ish and double check. And I want him to at least look at what I picked out. He's going to say, fine, whatever, I don't really. Basically, he say, he's going to say he doesn't care um, and that he has no opinion. But, I mean, I can tell by his face whether he has an opinion or not. Usually, he just lets me pick, but it's his house, too. He's got to look at it for the next however many years. So, so on, our lunch, on my lunch today um, and his, when he gets off of work, we are going to go check that out. And make sure that we like, and then we, we're going to get it scheduled. I think we're going to do it mid-September because we just have a lot going on between now and then, like little things. So they are booked out a couple of weeks, and we, um, then the weekend after that, Bob is working and fishing with Ben, and I'm going down to see some friends in the Chicago area and um, for the weekend since Bob is working again. And... Then, um, the weekend after that, on the sat on Saturday, I have a trial. I'm doing, that, that sounds funny, I have a trial. I think I told you guys, I'm, I'm just kind of starting to branch a little bit into freelancing. And I'm not comfortable yet to just show up at somebody's wedding and say, okay, let's do your makeup. <laughs> I'm not comfortable enough with that. I, I, and I'm too much of a perfectionist, really. So, um, I want them to, I want them to have a trial. So at the price that I'm charging, which is very minimal, by the way, at least I've been told it's very minimal. Um, I'm including a trial with them out at my house. I'm using the Camp Cosmetics Take Two Powder Foundation in case anybody's curious. So that, is, I have that that weekend and I don't really think they want to be in here when I have, you know, like makeup strewn about. You know, you know what I mean? Like if I have my room ripped apart, I just don't want it to look nasty. So, um, and then the weekend after that is Labor Day. And then the weekend after that is the day we're going to do the carpet. Or the week, weekend we're going to hopefully do the carpet. We have to schedule it and see if that will work for them. But if they're two weeks out, I don't see why we couldn't get that date. Brush hairs drive me crazy, can I just say. So, you guys, I'm telling you what, I'm trying really hard to work through this concealer. Um, but A, it goes to my fine lines and wrinkles, and, um, B, it doesn't cover anything. Like, can you, you can still see how dark my under eyes are. I do not appreciate that. Um, alright, so that's the, that's the deal with the carpet. I should probably stop talking, or this video is going to be really long, and my makeup that's supposed to be taking me five minutes will take me way longer. Alright, so I decided I wanted to get some stuff done around the house instead of... <laughs> going into work early again. Um, sometimes you just gotta do that. So I am just doing stuff. I was cleaning up a pile of, of um, mail that I needed to go through and I have to go in and shred something. When I go in there I'm going to show you one of the things that I need to do. I have all the camping stuff still because I had left it out because we were only camping two weeks apart from each other so I have all the stuff here in the tote there. Then you need to get that taken care of this weekend. Um, seriously, I'm like walking myself in circles. I'm telling you guys, it legit feels like fall at my house this morning. I was um, answering a comment yesterday to a subscriber, Alicia, who lives in Indiana. And she was saying how it was feeling like um, September and August, and that's exactly how it feels today with the cool air, like the kind of the smell, you know, that kind of wet leaf kind of smell, you know what I'm talking about? You feel me? Um, I'll do that, that later. So, let me just stick this in there. So, I um, decided just to wear my little Ked sneakers today. By the way, for those, anybody that's curious or <laughs> knows I'm trying to wear supportive shoes, these Keds have like an ortho heel or something. And so they're, they work pretty well on my feet. I'm going to show you a quick outfit of the day. Again, not much to it. The most boring <laughs> outfits of life. 
But um, I don't know. I'm just in a, I'm in kind of an outfit rut, I guess. So I tried to jazz things up with a necklace. Um, this, these are just same old Lane Bryant seven jeans. And then this t-shirt, I think I got this at Kohl's maybe? I'm pretty sure. So I think the brand is Croft and Borrow, 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 whatever. Um, so yeah, it's just a long sleeve t-shirt that I push up to be three quarter length. This necklace I've had for a long time. I don't know where it came from. It was a gift. And these earrings are still in dot studs. I like that it's kind of a, like a brushed gold or antique gold kind of, so it works with the necklace. So I have my stuff packed up, everything I have to go with some notes there that I need to write back to people. We have our grocery list made, which is, which is good. I'm hoping that um, we'll be able to handle grocery shopping much more quickly tonight so I can get home, get on the treadmill and shower my hair with um, the Redken clarifying shampoo so that I am all ready to go for my color tomorrow morning. So, all right, with that, I'm going to pack myself up and I have no idea how much footage I have, so I'm going to upload it while I'm at work today, kind of see, and then maybe there'll be another check it. There probably will be. We'll let Bobby check in with you guys. So we'll see you in a little bit. All right, so it's 520. Say hello, Mr. Game. <sighs> that, really? That's what you Hello. <laughs> what do you think, Clay? I bought it out. Yes, you know, we've not talked about Big Brother at all. Yeah. So, sorry, that was probably a spoiler. Big Brother addicts. We are, <laughs> are you a Big Brother addict, honey? How could that be a spoiler by the time they see this? Because they some have people, watched it. Well, the, <laughs> well, apparently. That's their problem. If, <laughs> well, there you go. Bob has spoken. If you we have to. It for you, you cannot. It's, your fault. <laughs> it's on three times a week. You can't wait weeks to watch Big Brother, folks. <laughs> My goodness. Spoiler. <laughs> so anyway, so, Clay, 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 yeah. Well, Clay 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 have been, they have been, Clay. Um, Clay, they have been separated. So we have been watching Big Brother, and it's gone from boring to kind of interesting to boring. I don't really know. Yeah. I'm kind of pulling either for James or for the dentist, Johnny Mac. Yeah. I think that's who we're pulling for. But anyway. I'm just surprised that. You know, I, I, I think that, you know, after I thought about it, because I thought for sure Shelly was going to get voted out. Yeah, I'm surprised myself. And, well, you think about it, though. Remember, they also, they showed Derek and Cody from last year? Yeah. And how... That was funny. How, uh, I, and I really think Clay was more influential in the house than what we thought. I mean, Shelly was winning all the competitions, but he was influencing in her, who were the targets and... and who That's was going to be put up on the block? He was pulling the strings. You know, remember if you remember last year when Derek won in that what was his name? Colby. Col Cody. Cody took second, yeah. but the cowboy was there. What was his name? Caleb. Yes. Caleb, who thought he was in charge the whole time, yeah. but he really wasn't in charge <laughs> of anything. Right. Right. right? So that's what I think this was, and I think maybe people kind of figured that out, and that's why they got rid of him yesterday. Maybe. So we'll see. There you go. There's Bob's thoughts That's on Big my, Brother. If I spoil it for anyone, tough. <laughs> I mean, there's no excuse watching, folks. Okay? Oh, oh and I had a nap. Yeah. So, you got nothing. <laughs> so, Bob had a nap this afternoon. He actually got, I got to change arms for a minute. Just, just. You're not going to show me? <laughs> you just, uh, you know, regroup over there. All right, brother. So. <laughs> So this afternoon, he actually got off of work a little bit early, around noon, so that he could meet me at the carpet store, and then we picked out, I, I showed him what I picked out, and we got that all handled and scheduled and whatnot. So it's going in, like, the second weekend in September. So, having said all of that, um, then he I came home. I still have to work tomorrow. And it's, he does have to work tomorrow. So see this rain that's ha going on here? This has been Beautiful. going on, yeah, we're not complaining. It's been going on all day long. So what does that lend itself to? Bobby taking a nap. That's what that is. So I was out in the rain to go for medium for the carpet, and then I got out in the rain when I came out of work. So my face was a little bit not looking so good. So I thought, you know what? I don't. It doesn't really matter to me. I'm gonna wash my face, and then I brush out my hair a little bit, put up in a messy bun, and we are off to the grocery store with me looking like this. How you feel about me looking like this in public? I I should have wore a hooded mask. Yeah. <laughs> How do you really feel about me? It doesn't matter. Right. 
don't let someone dare to say one bad word. Right? You'll take them out. We'll so, put on the menu but, next week. <laughs> you can't swear by channel. I did. I did. That, that's, that's in the Bible. So I've just edited out. Oh, so anyway. <laughs> there's. Uh, yeah. But the, can we butt, refer to butt, butt whooping. <laughs> butt whoopings are on the menu next week, and I accepted the invitation. I just want everyone to know. He was being so sassy. I got to change my arm again for a minute. He was being so sassy last night when we were making the menu. I said, all right, on Tuesday we are having butt whoopings, okay? That's not what she said. It is not what I said, but there could be children watching this. Oh, that's right. So anyway, so he thinks that's pretty funny. That Maybe we should order I was handing out butt whoopings. I was handing out butt whoopings. Salad and you decide. Bar. So we are going to, I actually made a salad for lunch today and ended up not eating it because we had oh, you want leftover rips. stuff. Um, leftover stuff at work that anyway, there's a meeting so there's leftover like turkey and ham and stuff so I had that so I'm gonna have a salad tonight I don't know what he's gonna have but we because he wants to go to the corner bar tomorrow right Still might get some <laughs> oh boy all right this vlog is really long I know because there was already 30 minutes of footage before we started this little holy cow I know so I'm gonna have to edit some of that out but anyway we hope that you guys had a really great I don't week. think you should edit any of it that was all good stuff it was some of my stuff from earlier this week I will edit not you oh, oh. not you honey oh. certainly not you all right <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching we hope you had a great week and we will see you in the next one bye bye <laughs>